I wanted to know what is your view on the altar call in the church? Should it be a public profession of faith or should it be a private matter between man and God? Well, I don't think it's all necessarily an either or question there. I, uh, I don't practice, I generally practice altar calls in my preaching. Uh, I don't think that there's anything inherently wrong with giving altar calls. However, I think that altar calls are exceedingly dangerous for reasons that I've already mentioned. And that is that we are filled, our churches are filled with people who have made professions of faith who do not profess faith because they think, well, all I have to do is go forward in an evangelistic call, raise my hand, sign a prayer card. Those are all forms of professing faith. And I also don't think that we can ever need to manipulate God's work of salvation in the hearts of sinner. We pray, we preach as accurately as we can and pray that the Holy Spirit will take that word that is proclaimed and God has promised that it won't return unto his void. And it is the power of God unto salvation, which is the gospel. And so I don't feel like I need to manipulate that and, and add to it. And so my concern is to be as accurate and as uh, powerful as I can be in proclaiming the word of God and calling people to respond. But I don't call them to, to respond by marching down and out because, of the, again, I see it everywhere that people think that they are saved simply because they made a profession. And making a profession never, well, no, we all who are saved should make professions. Don't misunderstand me. But just making the profession doesn't mean you have the possession. And so that's where I would say it's a question here, not of, of ultimate right or wrong, an ethical question is so much a prudential question, what is the wisest way to proclaim the gospel?